Yo. Okay, here we are in Synfig, and I'm just going to give a brief overview of the program. So at the top, we have the standard menu that you will find in pretty much every single software. Right here, we have our tools. In this space here, we have our canvas. Here we have the canvas browser, the palette editor that allows you to edit the palette. The navigator that allows you to, well, navigate the canvas. And the info, which pretty much displays the coordinates of your actions within the canvas. So right here, we have the tools options. So if I should select any of the tools, its options would show up in this space right here. Here we have the layers panel. So for example, if I should select the circle tool and add a circle to the canvas, would see the layers show up here. Let me just undo that. Here we have our timeline and we'll use this when we're doing animations. Here we have our properties window. So if I should add an object to the scene, we would see that its properties show up here, which allows you to make changes to the object. Okay, so let me undo that as well. And let's talk about navigating the canvas. To move up and down, just left click on this scroll bar and drag it up and down. To move left and right, just left click and drag this one right here. Also, you can hold down your middle mouse wheel and move your mouse to move the canvas left, right, up or down. We can zoom out by pressing this button right here. And of course, we can zoom in by clicking on this one. You can zoom back and forth between 100% and the current zoom level by clicking on this button right here. This one zooms the canvas to fit the space, like so. You can change the name and the size of the canvas by going to Canvas, then Properties. Here we can change the name of the canvas to whatever we want. And below, we can change the width and the height of the canvas. So I'm going to change the width to, let's say, 1920 and the height to 1080. And you can also change the frames per second in the time menu. But let's leave that as it is right now. There are also additional options in this menu, but we won't be needing any of these. Let's go back to image. Click apply, then OK to accept these changes. Also, going back a bit, you can zoom in and out by holding down the control key and scrolling your mouse wheel up and down to move in and out. Also, by holding down the shift key and moving the mouse wheel up or down, you're able to move left and right. And if you scroll the mouse wheel by itself, you'll be able to move up and down. Moving on, we can create a new project by clicking on this icon right here or by going to File, then New. But I'll click this here. And now we have two windows. And you can of course create multiple projects in this way. The cool thing is that these all open in different tabs within the same space. So you can work on multiple scenes all at once. And yeah, we can change the name of any of these tabs by going back to Canvas, then Properties, and edit the name right here. And that's pretty much it. In the next video, I'll be talking about the tools and how to use them. Yo, Demardi.